My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. Look what we've got for you this time. A gorgeous, drop dead gorgeous 71 Jaguar XKE. The best part about it, the troublesome Jaguar motor was pulled. It's got a 351 Ford motor and automatic transmission. It's got ice cold air. Visit volocars.com and you can read all the specs, look at all the pictures, get the price. Not only on this one, but we have a couple hundred collector cars all for sale. That's at volocars.com. If you enjoy the video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on the bell icon. You'll be the first to see the next one that comes out. Right now, why don't you join me? Let's go for a spin in this Jaguar XKE. Just one of the best looking vintage cars of all time. That is just classic, long front end with the bubble coupe. Uh, just gorgeous. That's like artwork right there. And then they throw on those wheels, the polished aluminum. I think they're 18 or 19 inch wheels uh, with spinners. Just, just striking. And it's black. Uh, car's just beautiful. Underneath the car appears to be real solid. It does have its famous Jag rear end in the back. It's independent suspension with inboard disc brakes. It's got four coilover shocks. The front end looks like it's been gone through. There's new rubber boots and bushings and uh, shocks are new up front. It has disc brakes in front as well. Uh, it's got an exhaust system with uh, like glass pack style mufflers. I'll start it. You'll hear it in just a minute. The body is beautiful. I mean, it really fits nice. It is straight. No door dings. There's no rust, no damage. Uh, I just wiped the car down. You might find minor imperfections like a piece of dust in the paint or uh, something real petty, little tiny dimple or something like that, but there's no bubbles, no issues. The paint's polished out smooth and glossy. All the chrome on the car is very nice. It looks like it's always been a good dry car. I think this is all the original chrome. It's just enough patina that if you get right up on it, you know it's not new, but you stand right here and it shines like brand new. Uh, windshield's real nice. It's got some aftermarket mirrors. All this chrome also. Without my glasses on, it looks brand new with glasses and looking up close. You can tell it's original, but really nice. Uh, it has all the factory uh, glass with a soft tint. <clears throat> I do believe the rear bumper is re-chromed. So I looked at it close, that looked new. So we open the car up. Inside is redone, nice soft leather. This has the uh, hatch that opens. All carpeted, upholstered, uh, all done real nice. All the upholstery around the hinges. Uh, it's got the panel here and down below is one of the original chrome wire wheels. The seats have been reupholstered in the correct uh, leather. The headrests are redone. Those usually go bad, but it's all in mint condition, soft leather. Door panels are excellent. The dash pad has been recovered, has some custom pedals on the floor. It's got the original Jaguar wooden steering wheel, and it's got the cockpit style instrumentation and all the toggle switches. Uh, it is a C4 automatic that's Ford. It's got seat belts. We'll open the bonnet, and I was mistaken earlier. I said the windshield looks good. That's the windscreen, they call it over the pond. So it's a 351 Windsor, the performance build on it. Uh, it's got a Offenhauser intake, dual feed Howie carb, some nice finned aluminum valve covers, got headers, uh, HEI ignition system with big fat uh, Ford racing plug wires, has a custom uh, air cleaner cover over the top of it all. It's a factory air conditioning system. I got this car from a collector. He deals in some really nice stuff. Known him for decades. All of his stuff is like this. 
He knew it was coming here. He had it serviced right before he brought it here. Just spent $1,500 just having the car checked out. They serviced the air. It's ice cold. Uh, they just gave it a tune-up. Uh, so why don't I start it up for you? You can hear it run. Everything inside looks stock except there is a radio and uh, two speakers. That door doesn't want to stay open. You don't need to, like the old Jaguar motor, pull the choke and hold it and crank it and let it warm up for five minutes. This will start right up. And one of these switches is for the headlights. Sounds like a sports car. Got twin electric fans on the radiator. Apparently I did not hit the right switch for the headlights. Anywhere you go in this car, you know it's going to get compliments. Turn down the interior lights. There's a whole row of toggle switches. I can't read what they are, but uh, the lights do function on the car. Visit volocars.com if you want a one-of-a-kind striking automobile that you can drive. Plenty of ways on there to contact us. We can help answer any questions about the car, your concerns, the delivery, the financing. However we can help, let us know. That's at volocars.com. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and click on the bell icon. You'll be the first to see the next one that comes out. Thanks for watching.